WFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 1 p.m. update. And currently we have all the U.S. indices trading to the downside. You've got the Dow off 26 points. That's a little less than uh, one-tenth of a percent. Or, uh, yeah, one-tenth of a percent. The S&P is up about uh, half a percent. Uh, that's off 20 points. NASDAQ 100 off 88 or six-tenths of a percent. The Russell's off one and three-tenths, 27 points. The semis are off one and four-tenths or 44 points out there. Gold's off seven-tenths or 14 bucks. Silver's down three percent, 75 cents. She's trading out of 24.15. Lights we crude up 74 pennies. 102.93 is a print there. Natural gas back 14 cents, trading out at 6.79. The 30-year Treasury's off one and uh, one point and... 1930 seconds, 139.14 is its print. Let's go take a look at the nine panel market update chart. We begin with the ES Mini. What we can see here is that uh, price has uh, struggled to get above the top of its weekly profile. So you've got really two resistance zones. The top of the weekly profile is 44.80. The center of the daily profile is 45.12. That's your resistance zone. Now, with price uh, being back below the uh, bottom of its daily profile, that's 44.52, that suggests a run back back for its uh, TD9 count, uh, 4375-ish type area out there. Maybe it's a rising trend line. Um, but that's what it, that's what the ES Mini is telling us. You've got the uh, spot volatility still below its 50-day exponential moving average and rising. It may be targeting a 2368 level at 50-day exponential moving average. The spot, I'm sorry, the Nasdaq, the NQ out here is pulled back and is trading right into its TD9 count. So if we were to close below 13893.75 today. Straight at 13,903 right now. That would negate that signal. And that would suggest that price might pull back into the 13,405 area. That's the bottom of its weekly bullish structured profile. Uh, the U.S. Uh, dollar is uh, strong. It does have a topping pattern. It confirmed a Rhodes momentum indicator top. Did that yesterday. But as long as price remains above the top of its daily profile, which is 100.18, you're right now trading at 100.58, conditions will remain neutral, unless it takes out the highs of yesterday. Gold is pulled back. It is now what's been testing the top of its daily profile, which is 1948. You trade in 1942. A closable 1940. 48 would suggest run for the 1917 level. Silver might be targeting 24.29. Light free crude not doing a whole lot out here. Natural gas should have support about 662 and persistence of the 30 year treasury is 143. Folks, thank you for the Trader Zed show. The drop to start your Thursday. Have a terrific one. Thanks for the show.